Hi guys, so I'm actually making this video um, to assist um, to anyone who felt they have been a victim of scams or any criminal offence by uh, anyone from Singapore. Uh, this is actually a good website for you to take a look and make a report against this scammer. Um, as you all have known that in my last two videos that I have put up on this uh, scammer, um, I'm happy to say that uh, two other sellers and I, uh, we have finally gotten our money back. Um, we felt that this scammer would have not come forward or reply back our emails if we have not um, detected who he is. And um, he actually owns a store. And he's actually quite well known already in Singapore. Um, so I will not be in indicating, um, I will not say out his name or the shop name uh, because the whole purpose of this video is uh, reporting the scammer. So I hope this video will help. So this is the website address, guys. And um, you can actually uh, click on this. Scroll down guys and you will see this facts on lodging report, click on it and you can actually lodge a complaint with CAB. Here you can actually there's two links, so click on the first one. For my case it's actually this one. And there's actually three ways of uh, reporting this uh, crime and it can be written form in person uh, if you are from Singapore or it be complaints uh, by electronic police center so for those who are outside of Singapore like for myself um, I can actually make a complaint in person or through uh, electronic police center so if you were to click on this a new page will actually be pop out and for any reports to be made, you have to include your passport number, your date of birth, and for our case, uh, it would be the crime, and click enter. Um, I have yet um, to fill in yet because I'm still um, in the midst of writing a full report on this scammer, which he claimed it is done solely by Denise Ang Chong Ling. But um, after checking with other sellers, we felt that uh, it may possibly be done solely by one person himself. And if you all have known that most of this um, address that was sent to is through P.O. Box. And I have checked with my friend from Singapore that um, any unlawful activities or fraudulent purpose for opening of P.O. Box for this case um, the commercial affairs or the authorities will actually um, will be able to uh, get all the relevant information from the respective P.O. Box um, if they find that a lot of sellers like us or any crimes that have been done in Singapore, they will uh, take actions. So I hope this um, website is helpful and I do hope that any sellers um, who has got a chargeback from this guy are uh, Denise Ang Chung Ling uh, or Ling Chung Ang. But we suspect that he has uh, a lot of other names that we are aware of. Um, Please come forward and make a report on this person because um, we felt that he may have scammed quite a number of sellers globally. We are fortunate enough, the other two sellers and I, uh, we were able to get back our funds after we have gone through a lot of comparisons of this particular person. Um, hopefully these efforts will help to assist other sellers to get back our funds back and if they don't uh, please come forward and make a police report or a report on this uh, scammer through this website so yep
that's pretty much about it. And um, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.